William Blake was a poet, an artist, and a uh, general mystic from the late 18th and early 19th centuries. Um, and this uh, is the Thames and Hudson Complete Illuminated Books uh, of William Blake. It's, uh, it's an, an oversized paperback and it's very, very nice and I just can't wait to show it to you. I've had this particular copy for, well, for about 10 years. Um, it's still in print. Uh, you can still find it on, on Amazon and I thoroughly, thoroughly recommend it to you if you are interested in uh, William Blake at all. It, um, it does contain every single one of his illuminated books and the art is just sumptuous. The, uh, uh, the, the poetry uh, is, is obviously, it's, it's absolutely wonderful as well. Here are the contents. I'll let you uh, um, pause to see if the particular book that you're after is there. What's nice in here is that you get the transcripts of the texts right at the very back uh, so that um, if the uh, if the handwritten texts um, that you can find um, in the books themselves uh, aren't to your taste for whatever reason uh, you can um, you can find the the printed version uh, right in the back. Uh, so I, I'm showing you already some um, some some of the prints inside. Uh, you get uh, you get a, a chronology, of course, and uh, and an introduction, um, giving you a, a good idea of of who William Blake was. Although um, obviously it is just a, an overview. There are there are plenty of um, uh, biographies that you can find if you're very interested. And then, um, and then you start with the um, the early illuminations, the early books, and uh, the much smaller um, uh, prints from his early career. So those smaller books, of course, uh, take up much less space on the page, but they've been reproduced in their original size. And you just uh, focus in a little bit. On those. It's absolutely delightful. The um, um, you may know that uh, William Blake was uh, uh, the author of the um, the little quotation from which Aldous Huxley um, took his title for The Doors of Perception. Um, William Blake was the one who coined that um, title. He said that when the doors of perception would be cleansed, then we would see reality as it really was. Okay. And then you start getting into the slightly larger um, prints and, and texts. It's very famous. Um, God the Creator. Um, yeah, you can literally spend hours and hours 
just looking at the uh, the illustrations, uh, just looking at his amazing art, very very distinctive, very recognisable art, um, and. Uh, um, and then, of course, studying the texts, which are very interesting. He was a he was a uh, a great critic of Milton. He he thought of Milton as a um, as a dullard. <laughs> he thought that Milton uh, was taking Christianity way too literally and uh, not bothering to search for the. Um, for the for the real human uh, meaning beneath the surface, um, and he was quite vocal about that, and uh, and that actually comes comes across uh, in his writings. So the. Yeah, the, the text is quite readable, um, but uh, but yes, as I say, if if um, if you'd like something a little a little more um, readily visible <laughs> uh, that requires a little less squinting, uh, then you can just turn to the back and uh, and have that text black and white. Some rather uh, alchemical, cabalistic um, diagrams. There, you can clearly see his uh, his influences. So obviously I'm I'm skipping most of the pages. I'm just giving you a, a general idea of the quality of the uh, of the prints inside. Can't actually imagine a better copy <laughs> than, um, than than this, a, a better a better edition. Other than the cover, I mean, it would be lovely if it were a a, a hardback, um, but um, but this is just a a, a real delight. There we go. So um, I'll. Uh, I'll leave you with these. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching uh, this video. Uh, do give me a thumbs up, a thumbs up if uh, if you have the time, <laughs> and uh, subscribe if you'd like to see more um, reviews of uh, some beautiful books. Also, uh, I've been doing some uh, more esoteric books recently. I'll uh, have a few more of those in the near future, and uh, some children's books as well. Um, as long as they're beautiful. <laughs> uh, I uh, will see you soon. Um, thanks for watching.